Well, the owners of a tourist attraction in Niagara Falls have now been told they could soon be taken to court. It has been about three months since a man died while riding through the Lockport Cave. Now, some tourists and even some employees say they were injured as a result of the company's negligence. Our Jordan Johnson spoke to an attorney who represents some of these folks as a notice of claim has now been filed. New claims have been filed against the Lockport Caves and Underground Tours. I learned about these new accusations after they appeared in documents filed ahead of a City of Lockport meeting planned for Wednesday. In these documents, employees and tourists who were on the boat on June 12th at 1130 a.m. were injured due to, quote, negligence, carelessness, and recklessness on the part of the employees and owner, Tom Callahan, of the tours. I met with the attorney representing the claimants, Terrence Connors, in his office in Buffalo. He says these notices of claim give Niagara County City of Lockport and the tours 90 days to take stock of the case before an actual lawsuit is filed. They have a right then to ask us to produce our clients so they can ask them questions. Once those questions are completed, they then will evaluate the case and decide whether they want to resolve the case or whether it must go to the next step, which will be litigation. That means that we would file a formal lawsuit, not just a notice of claim, but an actual lawsuit, um, and the case would proceed through the normal discovery process. But another issue is developing with the Lockport Caves. Customers are claiming they never received refunds for their tours that were canceled due to the deadly incident in June. Like Christina Louise, who posted on Facebook that she never got a refund for her tour planned for July 31st, when she drove six hours for the tour and showed up to the building being closed. Christina paid $103 in April 2023 for six tickets. And as you can see through these emails, the cave tours say they were locked out of the booking system after the incident and could not give refunds, which brought me here to Lockport, where I went inside the Lockport cave tours and was told the owner, Tom Callahan, was unable to do an interview. Then called the company's lawyer, George Berkwit. I was hoping to speak with you today, talking about your client with the Lockport Caves. Um, just hoping to get a statement from you if possible. I had to leave a voicemail. I reached out to the city of Lockport Common Council, the city of Lockport mayor, and even the Niagara County attorney, who all say they do not comment on pending litigation. In Lockport, Jordan Johnson, 7 News. Jordan, thank you for that. Back in Buffalo.